If you are sick and need medical treatment, you go to a doctor. If a car is not working properly, you bring it to a mechanic. If something in your home stops working, you call someone who knows how to fix it. Then why do so many Christians refuse to open their Bibles, where the Scriptures can teach and guide us through all of life's struggles? According to most online surveys, a majority of Christians do not read the Bible and may only open their Bibles or use a Bible app on the Sundays they actually attend church. So you may ask, why read the Bible? The Apostle Paul answers this question. All Scripture is inspired by God and is useful to teach us what is true and to make us realize what is wrong in our lives. It corrects us when we are wrong and teaches us to do what is right. There was a time in my life I was guilty of not reading my Bible. I was struggling with being single, dealing with crushing loneliness, and I eventually stopped reading my Bible daily. And then, surprise, I started drifting away from God. Though I didn't realize it immediately, avoiding the Bible had me feeling more lonely, and I became more irritable, angrier, and more susceptible to temptation. But after some time, God convicted me about not spending time in His Word, and I changed course. The pain of loneliness did not go away overnight, but being reminded of the truths of the Scriptures, like, how much He loves me, how He has plans for my life, how He is always with us, and nothing is impossible for Him, really started to give me strength. Though I couldn't stand being single, this ultimately led to me teaching a singles Sunday school class. After seven years of ups and downs, struggling with loneliness, God sent me a beautiful woman who eventually became my wife. When you are not sure about a decision you need to make or how to handle a problem you face, you should definitely pray about it. But you also need to search and study the scriptures so you will know or be reminded of the truths of God's word and what his commands, expectations, and promises are that he has given us. Will you understand everything written in the Bible? No, but that's why we pray, we study, and we seek godly advice from other believers who are full of wisdom that we respect. Reading the Bible consistently is a big step in drawing closer to God. And learning Scripture equips us with the power of the truths of God to face the troubles, the problems, and especially the temptations that come against us. Remember when Jesus was in the wilderness? How did he respond to the devil's temptations? All three times, Jesus responded with Scripture. So if it's been a while, pick up your Bible again. Begin to study God's Word daily so you can learn, be better equipped, and ultimately grow closer to Jesus, our Savior. Dear God, please give us the strength to stop making excuses, to put down our phones, to turn off the TV, to push out all distractions for a few minutes a day so we can study your Word with purpose and intent and to ultimately have a deeper and closer relationship with you. In Jesus' name we pray. Amen.